Hey YouTube, it's your girl Miss Antisocial. I'm back to finish up the tutorial that I did for you, that I was doing for you in the last video. Um, and again, I will be using the curly hair that I talked about, and that is by Zuri. It's called the Boom Quattro, Quattro um, 8, 10, 12, and 14 inch. So right now what I'm doing pretty much is just molding my hair and um, I'm basically just molding it with some regular gel, um, pump it up and um, that's it. And this is the pump it up that I showed you in the last video and just some regular gel, That that's it. And basically when I mold my hair, I only really mold like this part, this part, this part, you know, and in the back. Um, the reason I do it like that is because I'm already putting a stocking on my head and I already put, you know, gel and everything when I do the stocking. Um, so when I take it out, I really don't have any glue in my hair. I might have a little, and I do mean a little, glue right here from where I do my invisible part, but that's it. So, um, so basically... You know, you just take your gel, and excuse me if I look up in the mirror, because it's kind of hard to kind of do it in this camera. But, and the reason I do that is because I don't, for, for one, I don't like sitting under a hair dryer. And for two, I don't feel like blow drying my hair that long. I feel like a quick weave is supposed to be quick. That's why you call it a quick weave. So, right. <laughs> okay, so, you just make sure that your edges and the top part in the back is it, it has enough gel pretty much for the stocking to stay and the stocking is going to stay either way it go either way it goes because you're going to put the pump it up in it as well so oh and i just have it braided in a little um plaid in the back so you're just going to comb it just to make sure you don't have any bumps or whatever And I did, like I said, decide to go with the um, center part. Okay, so I'm going to spray it. Right before I put my um, cap on. And the reason the last video went out because I need to delete a lot of videos and pictures out of, out of um, my storage so that I could have some room. But you pretty much just, uh, I hate putting these small stockings on my head, but oh well. So you just pretty much Put your scarf on, your um, stocking cap, I'm sorry. Spray it again. And you're just going to blow dry it. And after I blow dry it and get it kind of hard, I'm going to come right back to you. But when you blow dry it, it should only take about three to four minutes just to kind of blow dry you blow dry once that pump it up or whatever kind of spritz you decide to use once that um gets harder it's hard enough for you to lay tracks then you're fine um but i do it twice i spray blow two to three minutes spray again blow it's dry start my tracks so i'll see you right back okay so i'm blow drying it it's been about um three minutes it's a little dry now, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to spray it one more time. And I'm going to hit it with the blow dryer again. And I'll be right back. Alrighty, so I'm finished blow drying my hair. And now it's time for me to go ahead and lay the tracks. Um... You can you can pretty much use any kind of glue you want to use. I have three different kind of glues sitting here. Um, it's like the 30 second glue. Then it's just the um, other glue, Max Professional glue. So basically, you can use any glue you want to use as long as the stick use it. Okay, um, as long as it's binding glue. Um, once you do all of that, you're gonna um, open up the pack of the of your tracks or whatever it is. And you're going to measure how much of the track that you actually need to use. So you're going to start at the bottom of your head. I hope you can see. 
see. And I like to start it kind of like right down here because I do like um, sometimes to like lift it up into a ponytail or whatever like that or um, wear it to the back or whatever the case may be. So once you do that, and this is about as much as tracking that I'm going to use for the first piece. And once you do that, you're going to put your glue on your track right here. Once you do that, you just start gluing, laying the tracks, basically. Like, you lay your track, you measure your next piece, lay that, lay that, lay that. So, um, when I kind of get to the middle of my hair, I'm going to come back on to kind of show you that. But I'm also going to show you how I lay it in the front so that if you want to wear it to the back, it actually looks like your hair. So, once again, I'll be back by the time I get to the middle. Alrighty. Alrighty, so I'm at the middle of my head. And that was the 14 inch and that is gone but um yeah so this how I look so far um what I was about to say oh um I know you seen me use the blow dryer just now so whenever I do lay a track I, I put the blow dryer on it just so it could kind of um dry quicker okay so I'm about right here about mid top to my head all right so I am going to go ahead and start on the 12 inch this is the 14 i'm going to the 12 the next is the 10 and then the 8 so i'll be back okay so i'm almost done with the 12 inch so i just wanted to show you what you need to do but when you get to your sides so whenever you get to your sides you can see um this is where my side will start and i usually use black stockings so i'm kind of glad that i use this stocking because um I can see my hair better with these colors, with this color. But um, I'm putting a glue on my um, track. So once you put the glue on the track, you're going to lay it right against your hairline. and that's so if you ever you're gonna cut this but when you if you want to wear it to the back you can wear it to the back without um you starting any of your hair because of course you don't have any of your hair out but it just looks um oh lord i ran out of glue it just looks a little bit more realistic if you do it like that and the next one you're just going to lay that track a little bit above the one you just did. Okay, so when you start um, laying the other ones, you can kind of lay it like that. And just go ahead and just start tracking it. Lay the next one. Track it, then track it, then track it. Okay? 